We just got back from Divers Direct and I got a few goodies in here I'm going to show you. Matt is a Patty scuba dive instructor and dive master. I am a brand new novice in this and I'm going to start learning soon. So I'm really excited because I got some good goodies in here to get me started. Oh, what else we got in here? This guy. You guys know what this is? It's a snorkel tube. <laughs> no? <laughs> what is it called? Just a snorkel? Oh. This is a snorkel. All right, next we got my goggles. I'm really excited about these. They are really nice. So the reason we picked these goggles was for a few reasons. And I'll show you. One, it has a GoPro attachment on the top, so that way I'll be able to record and see what Matt's doing or anything else in front of me. If there's any cool fish I wanna show you guys, or eventually I'll get into spear fishing or lobster hunting, you guys will be able to see me in action as I do those things. And it fits. So Matt got a new goggle strap. because has a goggle mask with a couple of spear guns underneath it. Pretty neat. I also got one. Mine doesn't have any emblems on it, but I had a reason for that. I got this one. And the reason is I need to replace the straps around my mask because it is uh, plastic and it'll pull on my hair. And it's after a while, I'll start going bald every time I go in and out and it's yanking all those hairs. So you see, it's not very hair friendly for women. Um, so we got one of these, we'll replace that strap and it has a hole in the middle so that way I can put my hair through it and it'll hold my goggles and my hair in place. So that's really neat. One very important thing is a dive flag. We need to put this on there, uh, put it up on a boat when you're in the water, whether you're scuba diving or snorkeling. So that way other boats know you're in the water and don't run you over. <laughs> it's kind of a big deal. But, da 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 da, beautiful. It's huge. We also found this little guy here. <laughs> this will be another one we can utilize. It's a little beat up, but still usable. Everyone from far away can see it's a dive flag. It's got a, a nice wire that runs along the back here to keep it open and fluffing while you're scuba diving or snorkeling. And it's filled with stamps still. What else we got in here? A waterproof dry bag. This is very important. Uh, I've been on boats where my bag is not waterproof. A wave or a little bit of water will get in and it's completely soaked. My towels will be in there, my spare clothes, not ideal. So we got this cute water bag. Next up, what do we got here? Knives. Very important. This one, this one is mine. Look how sharp it is. Bing, bing. If I could get it out, it's specifically for murdering fish. So I've been taught that you take this pointy end, you put it in their eye and poke their brain with it. <laughs> back. I put this one down. This is Matt's belt. He's got the nice tiny knife in it. My belt. Here we go. It's the blue one. And I got my own set of weights. Two, four pounds. I got to set it up with my knife and everything. So for Christmas, I got Matt a spear gun. Oh, this is so nice. There's the pointy end. Do, 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 do. Oops. And the shotgun then. Training begins today. Begins today. <laughs> Thank you.
So that's good. That's more than enough weight for you. I, I need some weight. Okay. The trick is when you exhale, you should float at eye level with all your gear on. Completely exhale. Oh, perfect. Cool. You have four pounds is enough. Thank you everybody for watching Sailing by Felicia. If you like what you saw, don't forget to hit subscribe. If you have any questions, comments on the process or gear, or even how to just blow bubbles, just give us a shout out below and do not forget to share with your family and friends. Bye everybody.